Hey everyone tuning in. Um, my name's Frank. This is my <laughs> wife Linda. And, I'm laughing already. <laughs> um, and we're starting a online business called Two Dog Vintage. Uh, basically going to be selling stuff online, uh, collectibles, vintage trinkets and stuff that we find. Uh, we've been doing this for a while, right? Yeah. Linda's been doing it for a long time, right? Yeah, since I was seven, going and teaching on the weekends with my mom and dad and my no. sisters. <laughs> no, and uh, she got me into doing this. We've been married a few years now, but we've been together 10 years. <laughs> a few years, if you don't remember. Three, four. <laughs> four. 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 We've been married four years now, since 2019. Wow. Um, and me personally, I've collected uh, from a young age, I used to buy and sell comic books and, uh, and then I got into music. I played guitar. So I was always buying and selling guitars and guitar gear and, uh, been selling stuff on eBay, uh, for a while, comic books, collectibles. Oh, that's what I forgot about when I yeah, you had sold eBay. stuff on eBay and I was, back then they would give you certificates and stuff if you were like a star, a star performer and they actually would call you on the phone to congratulate you and all that stuff. So I was a star seller mm -hmm. on eBay back in the day when eBay was kind of new. <laughs> yeah. So, and uh, I've had my account on eBay for a long time. Uh, if you want to look it up, it's uh, buzzy underscore fret on eBay and we've been using that recently for selling on eBay selling some stuff that we've found um, we've tried a couple different things we've been uh, you know just to back up a little bit we've got uh, Linda's had a space in a cut in several different uh, had let me had spaces in several different antique stores uh, where she's been selling um, and then uh, she kind of got out of that for a while uh, and then once we got together, I kept telling her, you need to get back into doing this. You, you like doing it and you know what you're looking for. You're really good at it. Um, and, uh, so I've kind of gone along for the ride and she's kind of got me into it. I guess I'm a, I'm a collector by, you know, just by nature. Uh, and then she just but loves. But you like it. You know you do. Yeah. Yeah. It's fun. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta admit, everyone the, yeah. the hunt is fun going out and looking <laughs> for stuff and finding things. And you meet really cool people mm -hmm. at like estate sales and auctions and different places and it's it's fun. It's like a a nice group of people. Yeah. There's a lot of cool people. Mm -hmm. Interesting people too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. So uh for the last few months, we've had a, a spot in a store local here. We're in, if I didn't mention it, we're in Gainesville, Florida. Yeah. Or actually, we're in Alachua, which is right next to Gainesville, Florida. And we have a space in a store called Antique City Mall. Mall. Antique City <laughs> Mall. I keep wanting to call it Antique Music City Hall or something like that. <laughs> Anyway, uh, it's, in, it's in, Micanope. in Micanope, and it's a really cool store. It's a giant it place with a lot of sellers, and there's mm -hmm. a lot of cool stuff there. But we're finding, it, for us, it's not working out that great um, financially. Uh, I mean, it's a great place to come and shop. They've got tons of really cool vendors, and I mean, if you want it, they probably have it. Um, but... Yeah, the the antique booth thing. I mean, it's it's okay for a while, but then it seems like it gets to a point to where you want more. Well, like one, you want your own. Yeah, you thing. want to have your own thing. Yeah. I, part of the problem with it is, or I don't know if I want to say problem, but one of the the things about it is, is you've got to be able to go down there and work it consistently and constantly, and it's hard to do that. I also have a full time job. Linda has a cleaning business; she cleans, um, so she's got clients. 
So it's really tough to go down there and work it several days a week. And, you know, that's one of the things that you really need to do for that. Uh, and then there's the rent. Rent's yeah. expensive there. Uh, yeah. You know, and I'm not knocking it as they've got to pay their bills and they, they do, do a lot. They it's, a, do. it's a it's giant a really, place. And it's a really nice place. But it's a big, you know, it's, it's a big cost that adds to your business mm -hmm. when you're doing that. And uh, for the last few months, we've been, well, Linda started following some people on, on YouTube, watching other uh, people that do thrifting and, and antique hunting and uh, flipping stuff online, um, uh, nifty, thrifty, God, I'm blanking on the name of his, and we watch him all the time. Jeffrey. 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 Uh, <laughs> she was watching him. Uh, uh, the... Uh, God, I should have written down all these names. Uh, the flipping nurse. The uh, um, homeschooling. Homeschooling. With the um, yard sales, she's yeah. awesome. I, you know, I don't live anywhere near her, but I wish I did. I wish we were friends. I would so be there with her. <laughs> um, you know, I'll post some links to their. And um, Misty. Yeah, the. Uh, the uh, her her thing is long. I can never remember yeah. it. There's something. But what I'll do is I will put links to these people that we're mentioning, yeah, that we've been all, watching, yeah. and, and, and most recently another one, uh, Follow That Bug. Oh, yeah. We can remember that one. And the Philly Picker. The Philly Flipper. And um, Wick? Wick. Wick. Yeah. He's funny. He's yeah. awesome. <laughs> um, so anyway, we've been watching them, and we thought, well, maybe we should give this a shot. Uh, it seems to be working for other people. So, you know, we're already selling stuff online. We've got eBay, we sell on eBay. Linda's had a Macari account for a while. Um, we've got an Etsy. Etsy account. Because I make... Um, she also makes rings out of vintage yeah. earrings. Well, not just rings. And bracelets. And bracelets and bookmarks. And bookmarks, <laughs> yep. So we just recently got a WhatNot account. Uh, we're going to be selling on WhatNot. And, uh, yeah, that'll kind of take the place of us having a booth. Yeah. So most likely what we're going to do is end up closing down the booth by the end of this month and moving what's left out of there and then trying to sell online. And then uh, also, you know, using YouTube as a platform for uh, staying in touch with people, uh, letting people know what we're selling. Uh, posting videos of what we find, uh, trying to do some videos of out hunting, although that's a little daunting so far. <laughs> it's kind of crazy when you're out trying to walk around and look for stuff. And, you know, I watch other people do it, and I don't know how they how they do it yet. I just tell him, just relax. <laughs> just do it. it. It's just talking. Yeah. Just pretend. But normally... But, when you think of it, though, we'll be together, so it'll just be like we're talking to each other. Yeah. Well, there's he technical things. <laughs> so, which is weird because I, since I play music in a band and I'm used to being on stage and people staring at me, I don't understand why I why I let it bother me. But I, I guess I kind of get in the mindset of wonder, worrying about people seeing you videoing, and they're going to be like, "Hey, I don't want to be in your video. Don't don't video me." So it's kind of tough to. Do that so we've been watching how other people do it um i don't know why it seems like every time we watch somebody they go to like a a, a goodwill in their video there's like nobody in their goodwill we go to our goodwill and it's, and it's always crowded yeah. it's always yeah. crowded yeah the the sad thing is is that we, we go to our goodwill there's and no way really there's not always a lot of stuff there to no, find we don't have the best goodwill we find we we do our best we have goodwill envy on a lot of yeah. other but we have you know wills. there's salvation yeah. army and yeah. um haven humane society humane society linda finds a lot haven of haven hospice yeah. and um, estate sales habitat for humanity yeah and then we hit a lot of estate sales yeah, too and that the seems best. to be where we find the best i love estate sales we find the best things yeah um but um anyway so yeah we're uh, like i said we're going to start a we've got our whatnot account set up we just got approved uh we're, i'm going to put a link to that down there i'll put a link to some of the other things that we do the etsy and and whatnot and basically you know this is just our introduction video for our 
YouTube channel. I guess you could call it our coming out video. <laughs> yeah. And if I didn't mention before, which I think I did, we're, call, we're calling it Two Dogs Vintage, and that's because we've got our two dogs, um, yes. Gibson and Thor, who amazingly are not all over us right now. <laughs> Thor's asleep on the sofa next to us, but I don't know where we Gibson know. is. Gibson's probably upstairs sleeping on the bed. He's up to something. <laughs> um, but, uh, you know, you know, like everyone says here, uh, if you check this out and you like it, that'd be, you know, it'd be great if you would give us a like, subscribe, and comment, and uh, uh, let us know what you think, uh, if you got any tips, uh, you know. And you can, you can take this journey along with us. Yeah. <laughs> because we're starting this whole new thing here. Yes. And you can watch us grow, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> yeah try to sell some stuff and you know we'll we'll post some other things and uh who knows maybe some snippets of the band will make it in there too that would be, um, that would be cool but anyway some uh is there anything else you can think of that we're gonna say here mm. you can tell we hit, we we do a lot of planning <laughs> not well when you do a video it shouldn't really be planned because you just want it to be real. True. So this is us being real. <laughs> true. True. Um, yeah. So uh, I, you know, we hope that you will look at our, you know, check in on our channel in the future, and then definitely check in. You know, we're going to try to post this, you know, at least videos of stuff that we're going to be selling, letting people know uh, when we're going to be doing whatnot sales and um, anything else that we've got going on so if you're interested in in vintage and you know vintage antiques collectibles uh just cool stuff uh we're going to be trying to do our best to sell it and find it and sell it so what you think good <laughs> <laughs> all right well yeah, if it'll you, be fun if you've uh, checked this out and you've watched it this long, thank you so much. Yeah, really, if you've watched this long, wow, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, anyway, thank you so much. Uh, hope you check in and check out well, our... Happy 4th of our, July. Oh, yeah, happy 4th of July. It's, yeah. We're filming, we're videoing this. Why am I saying film? It's video. Uh, we're videoing this on July 4th, 2023. Yeah. And uh, so this is it. Be this safe is our, out there. If you're going to parties and stuff and don't forget about your fur babies the fireworks scare them so make sure they're you know in the house where they can't take off running because they're scared so um anyway this is our launch of two dogs vintage youtube channel so thank you so much and sorry the dogs didn't make it on the video this time they're both like dead asleep <laughs> I'll post some, I'll, I'll tag on some, vi some footage of the dogs. Anyway, thank you so much. We hope we see you on here again. Come check us out. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye. Really? Really? starving to death.